Good morning. My name is John Whitmayer. I'm the director of music ministry at Salem Lutheran Church and School in Afton, Missouri, and it's my privilege to bring you a devotion this morning. Today's devotion is another in the series of Monday Blessings written by my father, Pastor Gary Whitmayer, during his time in active ministry. Today's devotion is based on Psalm 16, verse 5, which reads, Lord, you have assigned me my portion and my cup. You have made my lot secure. Mercy, peace, and love be yours in abundance. Pastor Gary writes, I have always found it amazing that so many people think they know me better than I know myself. They give me assignments. When my time for playing a band instrument came, I went with every expectation of being a great trumpet player. The band leader said I had the mouth and lips just right for a trombone or baritone. And since only a trombone was available, I would be a trombone player. Besides, I had an arm long enough to slide the slide all the way out to the end. It worked out well for me. So it has been a good share of my life. I wanted to play shortstop on the baseball team, but a wise coach turned me into a happy and successful central fielder. I was going to be star forward on our basketball team, and a wise coach found me a place on the bench. I was going to be an engineer and create marvelous things with which to benefit mankind. And a wise creator called me to be an under-shepherd of his, writing Monday Blessings. I guess in modern day terminology, I have been pretty well victimized. I haven't gotten what I wanted. I didn't always feel good about what was assigned to me. Now, I suppose I should whine about how bad I've got it. but. Each of these assignments has enabled me to know myself and my abilities better. Even better, each has enabled me to know God better. He is trustworthy. God has assigned your portion in life and your cup, character building troubles, that you may learn that you are not a victim, but a soldier of the cross, a cherished child of the Heavenly Father, Jesus' brother at the wedding feast, as well as at the anguish of Gethsemane, and eventual death of Good Friday, that your lot may be secure. God assigns your lot that you may learn to live securely in the knowledge of the resurrection. Are you reluctant to get into the fray? Remember that one believer and God always constitute a majority. Tired and weary of life, you've got enough energy to last. You are made of good stuff, God's stuff. And he has assigned you that portion which remains unto eternal life. Will you pray with me? Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for assigning me that which will serve you and strengthen me. Remind me of your love and support as I live as your child. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you very much for listening today. May God bless your day and your week. Goodbye.